Philippines will be the number one nation in the world. Hello po, mga kajisi TV. Nakakatuwa pong pakinggan ang mga sinasabi ni Brother Sado Sandar, no? Silvara, na kung saan magiging number one po sa buong mundo ang Pilipinas o manguna po. Ito po ay totoo, no? Mangyayari po ito. Uh, matagalan man siguro, pero ito po talaga ay mangyayari. No, sa katauhan po ng ating mahal na ray ng Queen Helen Elizabeth III, Uh, magagana po talaga ang nakatakda sa propesya. Ako po'y naniwala sa ating mahal na Raina na si Queen Helen Elizabeth po sa ating mahal na hari, King Mamay, na talaga pong mangyayari o magaganap na magmumula po dito sa Pilipinas ang lahat mga ka-GCTV. No? Talaga pong ang Pilipinas ay siyang perlas ng silangan mga ka-GCTV. So ito po'y ating pakinggan ang kadugtong sa mga sinasabi po ng ating brother Sado mga ka-GCTV. Specific messages for the Philippines. I believe with all my heart that you are being prepared for a wonderful, great move of God in the nation of the Philippines. Like never before, ever seen in the history of the Philippines. I do not know much about the history of the Philippines, whether you have experienced any revivals in the past or not, whether you did or you did not. What is going to happen next? is going to be the greatest move of God that will even be talked about in the rest of the world concerning what God is doing in the Philippines. Such a thing has never happened before in any other nation. So can you imagine how blessed Philippines is? Amen. So all you wonderful Filipinos are greatly blessed for being born in the Philippines. Sometimes we think, oh, I'm so fated to be born in one particular nation. How nice it would have been if I was born in America or I was born in Europe. All, all this nice very advanced and developed nation but I say unto you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ the days are coming that people living in America people living in Europe will wonder and feel so sorry that they were not born in the Philippines Amen 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 they are going to envy the Filipinos and the Philippines. So they will want to come and apply for residency in the Philippines. And then you can tell them, sorry, no room. No more room, no more land available. This is going to happen. Do you believe? I say this with truth. I am not just saying a word of hope. This is a word of absolute certainty that because this is the will of God that God had revealed through his prophets during one of these conferences in the year 2012 or oh, sorry 2011 when God revealed his great plans for this nation of the Philippines, how he wants to bless the Philippines and cause it to prosper, not only spiritually, but also economically, and also in the areas of education, in the areas of science, in the areas of finance, in the areas of every area that you can think of, Philippines will be the number one nation in the world. Amen. Amen. 
10 days ago on 1st August the 8th channel to the Far East. Far East primarily targeting the Philippines. So only one person, one Filipino must be so excited. <laughs> Philippines is a nation that is going to experience a great exponential revival in the not too distant future. That is the destiny God has revealed about the Philippines. You know, when if you hear about the awesome word that has been spoken over the Philippines, you would wonder next to how God bless Israel. Philippines will be the second nation to Israel how God is going to greatly bless, prosper and lift her so high up that she will be like a beacon of a lighthouse for the world. So we have a responsibility to help the Philippines, the Filipino people in the church to know about the prophetic destiny of God. And that is why God has moved us to dedicate a special network for the Far East that will cover Japan, Korea, the Philippines and all the other smaller nations in the Far East region to hear the prophetic word of God.